Patrick Kane, the most dominant U.S.-born NHL player of his generation, captivated fans with his offensive brilliance and undeniable talent. With a relentless dedication to the game, Kane rose to become a hockey icon, but his journey was not without its share of controversy. In this video, we will dive into the background, early career NHL success, playing style, and address the controversy surrounding allegations of sexual assault against Kane. Background and Early Career Patrick Timothy Kane II, popularly known as Patrick Kane, was born on November 19, 1988 in Buffalo, New York. From a young age, Kane displayed a deep passion for hockey and dedicated himself to the sport. He would spend countless hours on the ice, practicing and refining his skills, which ultimately played a significant role in shaping his successful career. Kane's early hockey journey began with the Buffalo Saints, an elite tournament team. It was during his time with the Saints that he not only further developed his skills, but also began to cultivate his unique hockey personality. Known for his distinctive black aesthetic, Kane often wore black hockey gear, distinguishing himself on the ice. Beyond his appearance, Kane's attention to detail set him apart from his peers. He possessed a remarkable ability to read the game, anticipate plays, and execute with precision. These qualities, coupled with his exceptional stick handling, agility, and hockey IQ, made him a formidable force on the ice, even at a young age. Kane's talent did not go unnoticed, and he quickly gained recognition within the hockey community. His outstanding performances earned him numerous accolades, including being named the most valuable player of the 2007 IIHF World U18 Championships, where he led the United States to a gold medal. Following his successful stint with the Buffalo Saints, Kane moved on to play junior hockey for the London Knights in the Ontario Hockey League. During his time with the Knights, he continued to excel and showcase his skills on a larger stage. In the 2006-2007 season, Kane was awarded the M's Family Award as the OHL's Rookie of the Year. Kane's exceptional performance in the OHL attracted the attention of NHL scouts, and he was selected as the first overall pick by the Chicago Blackhawks in the 2007 NHL Entry Draft. At the age of 18, he made his debut in the NHL during the 2007-2008 season, becoming one of the youngest players in Blackhawks history. Throughout his early career, Kane continued to make significant strides and solidify his position as one of the premier players in the league. He showcased his offensive prowess, creativity, and scoring ability, earning him multiple NHL awards, including the Calder Memorial Trophy as the league's top rookie in 2008. Patrick Kane's background and early career laid the foundation for his future success in the NHL. His passion for hockey, dedication to improvement, and unique hockey personality helped shape him into the exceptional player he is today. NHL Career and Playing Style When Patrick Kane was selected as the first overall pick by the Chicago Blackhawks in the 2007 NHL Entry Draft, it marked the beginning of a remarkable NHL career. Kane wasted no time in making his presence felt, quickly establishing himself as one of the league's most exciting and talented players. Kane's arrival in Chicago coincided with a turning point for the franchise. The Blackhawks had been struggling for years but were on the cusp of a resurgence. Alongside fellow young phenom Jonathan Taves, Kane became an integral part of the team's transformation into a powerhouse. Kane's playing style is characterized by a combination of skill, speed, creativity, and a relentless competitive spirit. He possesses exceptional puck handling abilities, with an uncanny ability to maneuver through traffic and elude defenders. Kane's stick handling skills, combined with his agility and quickness, allow him to make intricate moves and dekes, leaving opponents bewildered. One of Kane's trademark moves is his spin-o-rama, a maneuver in which he spins his body while maintaining control of the puck, creating scoring opportunities or opening up passing lanes. This move has become synonymous with his playing style and has often left goaltenders and defensemen helpless. Kane's offensive prowess is evident in his scoring ability and playmaking skills. He has a lethal shot, possessing a quick release and remarkable accuracy. Kane has a knack for finding open spaces on the ice, positioning himself to unleash his accurate and deceptive shot. His vision and hockey IQ allow him to make precise passes and set up his teammates for scoring chances. Throughout his NHL career, Kane has consistently produced impressive offensive numbers. He has been a consistent point producer, amassing multiple 100-point seasons and regularly finishing among the league leaders in scoring. His ability to contribute offensively in crucial moments, such as overtime or during playoff runs, has also been a significant factor in the Blackhawks' success. Kane's impact extends beyond his individual statistics. 
His partnership with Jonathan Taves became the cornerstone of the Blackhawks' success, with the duo forming one of the most formidable tandems in the league. Together, they played pivotal roles in leading the Blackhawks to three Stanley Cup championships in 2010, 2013, and 2015. Off the ice, Kane's offensively gifted style of play and charismatic personality have made him a fan favorite. He has a knack for performing in clutch moments and has earned a reputation as a player who rises to the occasion during crucial games. Overall, Patrick Kane's NHL career has been nothing short of extraordinary. His dynamic playing style, exceptional skills, and ability to consistently produce offensive magic have cemented his status as one of the league's elite players. Kane's contributions to the Chicago Black Hawks and his impact on the game of hockey have solidified his place as one of the greatest players of his generation. Controversy. Is he a rapist? In 2015, Patrick Kane found himself at the center of a highly publicized controversy when he faced allegations of sexual assault. The incident occurred during the offseason, shortly after the Chicago Black Hawks had won their third Stanley Cup championship. The allegations were made by a woman in her 20s who claimed that Kane had sexually assaulted her at his off-season home in Hamburg, New York. The news of the allegations sent shockwaves through the hockey community and garnered significant media attention. The incident was extensively covered by the press, and it quickly became a major talking point, both within and outside of the sports world. The investigation into the allegations was carried out by the local authorities, and the case attracted intense scrutiny. However, in November 2015, the Erie County District Attorney's Office announced that they would not be pursuing charges against Kane. The decision not to proceed with criminal charges was attributed to significant material inconsistencies between the complainant's accounts and those of other witnesses. The District Attorney cited a lack of credible evidence and the inability to prove the case beyond a reasonable doubt as the reasons for their decision. Despite the conclusion of the investigation and the absence of criminal charges, the incident had a lasting impact on Kane's public image. It led to a significant amount of controversy and speculation, as well as divided opinions among fans and the general public. The allegations against Kane shed light on a larger issue surrounding sexual assault and the treatment of women in professional sports. The incident prompted discussions about the responsibility of professional athletes and the need for increased awareness and education surrounding consent and respectful behavior. In the aftermath of the controversy, Kane issued a statement expressing his gratitude for the support he had received and his desire to move forward. He acknowledged the impact that the incident had on his family, the Blackhawks organization, and his fans. Kane also emphasized his commitment to being a positive role model and learning from the experience. Since the allegations, Kane has continued his NHL career, and he has remained one of the league's most talented and productive players on the ice. However, the controversy has undoubtedly left a mark on his reputation, and it remains a significant aspect of his public image. It is important to note that the allegations against Kane did not result in criminal charges or a conviction. The legal system did not find sufficient evidence to support the allegations, and Kane maintains his innocence. Patrick Kane's journey from a young hockey enthusiast to an NHL superstar is a tale of immense talent, dedication, and success. While his on-ice achievements solidified his legacy as a Blackhawks legend, off-ice controversies have marred his career. Kane's impact on the game cannot be denied, but his legacy will always be intertwined with the controversy that followed him throughout his career. As fans, we are left to reflect on the complex nature of sports heroes and the impact their actions have on their legacies. If you enjoyed this video and would like to stay updated, don't forget to like and subscribe for more fascinating content.